Hey, and and you wouldn't think I'm going to high school soon, would you? Well, hello guys, and welcome back to another very stupid day on the Tupsa TJ channel, where today we are gonna be. Um, I forgot what we're doing. I've actually forgot what we're doing. We are going to be. Oh yeah, doing a tier list on Star Wars. How did I forget that? Remember them, the tier list things. You know, the the things that were popular like a year ago, and and they're easy to make. So I decided to make one. Guys, I'm just copying Seamus Gorman. I I don't know what to do. I just I, yeah. Let's just get on to it, okay? So we're gonna be ranking um the the Star Wars live action things. I don't really know what to call them. But all the live action Star Wars movies, uh, or TV programs, anything. Um, so Mandalorian's on here. We can't have Clone Wars because they're all animated. So live action. Let's get right to it. So starting off with the Ma the not the Mandalorian, um, the Phantom Menace, which is obviously Episode One. I like it. I think it's actually pretty good. Um, I know I know a lot of people dislike uh, One and Two. Uh, I know they have a lot of the fans, but I think it's pretty solid, so I'm going to put it in the B tier. Remember, I might move these after, but I think it suits in the B tier for now. So, um, yeah. Going on to Attack of the Clones. You know, I just watched it for the first time. It's the only Star Wars movie I'd never seen. And I thought it was okay. It's obviously not one of the best. I'm gonna put it in D. The dialogue is atrocious. It's kind of um. I don't want to watch it. I wouldn't want to watch it with my dad. That's all I'm trying to say. I would kind of cringe a little bit. Um, Revenge of the Sith. Well, we all know where not so. We all know where this is going. We all know where this is going. Revenge of the Sith is great. Like the dialogue's terrible and it kind of annoys me. You know, it does annoy me a wee bit because I hate the dialogue and it kind of makes it too unrealistic. So I kind of have my own different headcanon for it. Um, but overall, great film. It's good. Okay, it's really good. Solo, very underrated. Absolutely great. So I'm gonna put it uh, in the B tier alongside Phantom Menace I think it is I think it's better than the Phantom Menace actually so I'm gonna put it above the Phantom Menace like so yeah I do think it's definitely better than the Phantom Menace uh, Rogue One what can I say about Rogue One when I first saw it I was like seven dreadful it was an awful movie I hated it I rewatched it obviously for this and I think it's not as bad as I first saw it. I still aren't the biggest fan. Obviously, the ending battle with Darth Vader is absolutely next world. I don't understand. It's just that good. Uh, C tier for me, Rogue One. Uh, A New Hope. Um, remember, I didn't grow up with any of these movies. I'm kind of embarrassed. I grew up with the sequels. The sequels, for goodness sake. Um, A New Hope. You know... I don't think it's that good. I think it's the same. I think it's C tier with uh, Rogue One. Uh, obviously, it is original. Um, but still, I don't think it's absolutely mind boggling good. I think it's great. It's a great film. I love all these films, but it's not. It's not incredible. Um, the Empire Strikes Back, up in S tier. Um, you probably predicted that. I'm surprised I liked it that much. I watched it a few months ago uh, for the first time. I didn't see Empire Strikes Back and uh, I hadn't seen Attack of the Clones, even though I was such a big Star Wars fan. And I didn't see one of the best Star Wars movies. It's it's really good. It's really good. Um, it's like, a t it's the tense middle chapter. That's the best way to put it. Going on to The Turn of the Jedi. It has to go back up in S tier. I think it's better. I think, yeah, it's my favourite Star Wars movie. The Turn of the Jedi is my favourite Star Wars movie. I'm going to put it out there. Um, 
I don't like the Ewoks. Uh, I think a lot of people can agree on that. Um, but overall, the ending is just so good that I think it's not... I think it's a bit underrated. I think people say it's the weakest out of the original trilogy. No, I don't think so. Moving on to The Mandalorian. Love it, love it. Um, that's going up in A tier. First movie actually in A tier today. Um, sorry, that was a bit of a mess here. Let me just quickly fix that. First movie in A tier today. Sorry if Solo's getting a bit clogged up, but you can see it, kind of. First movie in A tier. Um, not a movie. It's a it's a series. It's a series. Uh, I love it. It's great. It's yeah, my fourth favourite bit of Star Wars. I, that's all I can say. Um, I love it. Force Awakens. Uh, I was six when this movie came out. Oh my goodness, I'm so young. Um, I went to go see it in the cinema. I loved it, obviously. It was it was really good. But now that I look back at it, I hate that everything just repeats itself. I don't I don't like how everything just repeats itself from um the last the original trilogy. Um so for that I'm gonna have to put it down and see. Um if they'd done it differently, uh, it would have been much better. The last Jedi. I like The Last Jedi. I think it's see again, not as good as The Force Awakens. I know everyone hates it. I almost everyone hates it. Um I think it's all right. I think it's fine. Um, I think it's fine. I don't know what to say. I think it's fine. Moving on to final one, The Rise of Skywalker. Um, hmm. I don't know where I'm going to put this. Okay, sorry for the room change. My camera ran out of battery, but I think I'm going to put Rise of Skywalker next to attack the clones in d tier i think it was all right it was fine um i don't like what they did with um bringing the emperor back i thought it was it was cool but when you really think about it it kind of ruins so much stuff like the chosen one stuff and stuff like that um the movie's good the movie's good um but it's probably my least favourite one. It got a bit boring near the end. Well, this is my final ranking of all the movies. Um, take a look at it. If you disagree, comment. I don't care. Um, but this is what I think about all the movies. And yeah, I love Star Wars. I think it's great.